We're visiting with Coach Nick Woodruff. Coach, you get the 78-65 win over Barry, and uh, they came in undefeated uh, in CAA Division III uh, opponent. But uh, they've got some athletic guys. What do you think about the effort to, tonight from you guys as we get ready for West Georgia next uh, on Sunday? Yeah, we won that game with the D in the first half. You know, the second half, we had a lot of lapses there. They, You know, that last few minutes, our guys just kind of gave in on some easy baskets, layups, fouling. We got to get a lot better with that type of stuff. But, you know, overall, I'm proud. We pulled that through. Um, we finally made a few shots. Like, thank goodness, you know, it's been a while. We, I think Jake said, like, in the last two games, we're like, or three games, I don't know, we're like five for our last 39 from the three. And we shoot the ball better than that. But um, I don't know what it ended up tonight. But, uh, you know, I think we were five for ten in the first half, and we finally made a few threes. And so that was good to kind of get that thing going with that. And um, But overall, you know, those are tough games. Those are tough. They're 8-0. No. They're supposed to, they feel like they're supposed to win. They average 80 three or 84 points a game um so you know I, I'm, I'm proud of our guys effort to do it uh obviously we didn't finish the way we would all like to do it but but overall we took care of business and got that thing done you know there down the stretch made free throws did a lot of good stuff there you know you talk about the free throws tonight i mean that's been one of the things that you know calling it what it is we've struggled at the free throw line at times um and, and tonight we shot 23 of 26 i mean 88 percent that that right there will will bode well for the future because that can win you some games in those close ones it can it can and, and that was one thing we did last year really well was we made free throws late and if we had a lead we were hard to beat because we made them and so sometimes it's just contagious missing is contagious and making is contagious so every one that those guys step up there they got to step up there and try to drain them and um, it, it's contagious, and it obviously was contagious tonight in making them. So, um, but yeah, it was a good effort there, and yeah, making free throws down the stretch. Yeah, it, 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 we had to make them because they were scoring. We couldn't get a stop. We had to make our free throws there just to keep them away from us. Yeah, I don't want to keep you too long, but I mean, Karan Garner he knocks in 22 and pulls down five. Um, you know, looking at it, Terry Durham again. He goes for a double double. He scores 13 and pulls down 16 boards, and he and he and he almost. I mean. I, I, I say it every single game. There's nobody in America that's ever played this game that falls any harder, except save save Justin Allison maybe, uh, than than those two guys. I know it. They fall hard. That's what jo <laughs> jo Joni's got her work. Joni's got her work cut out trying to get him ready by Sunday. But you know we got a we got our hands full Sunday, and um, I'm just glad we were able to get through that one, and we can get our our sights set on West Georgia. That's a that's a good ball team, and like they they've. I, I, they're impressive. They went down to Valdosta and beat them. Uh, they got Huntsville tomorrow, so we'll get a chance to see them. But they're, they're really good, and they've got some really good players, a bunch of old guys. Coach has been in the league a long time, and they, they'll, they'll be really good offensively. And, um, you know, they'll defend really well. They, you know, a lot of a lot of different things at you, whether it's switching ball screens or doubling the play. They just, they're just good. They're good. They're good. It's going to be a tough effort for us. And um, thank goodness it's at home. Give us an opportunity to, to play one more time here at home before the break. But but we've got our we've got to get you know ready for them quickly well i'll tell you it's it's a fun team to watch i look forward to uh, covering it on sunday folks that's your head coach nick woodruff